What's up guys, Dusty Rhodes here with Chasing the Wild. Just approaching the stream here, um, May 8th. Uh, perfect conditions, cloudy, overcast. Um, the creek conditions aren't exactly perfect. As you can see, a little bit clear, but um, there are some big trout in this stream. So I'm hopefully, I'm gonna work up through the section here and uh, hopefully tackle into a couple. So stay tuned guys, tag along. All right guys, I am just getting to the stream here. Uh, right up ahead here, there's a fallen log, water spilling over it. <clears throat> Got some redemption on a fish up in that pool. Um, hooked a giant, wow, that was horrible. Uh, anyhow, I hooked a giant wild brown up in that hole um earlier this year and it came off <laughs> so i need to hopefully have a little bit better luck on the uh <clears throat> hook set here that wasn't even the hook set I had the damn thing and it was should have been in the net and um, ended up not being able to get it in the net <laughs> kind of knocked it off there it popped off A heck of an undercut root right over here by this tree and then pretty deep all along so I'm just gonna try and get it right in tight to these undercut roots and hopefully it comes out that's where that's where I hooked it earlier in the year so, should be absolute money right there oh got it guys pretty damn discouraging right there not gonna lie I got two redemptions now <laughs> uh, I'll tell you what though guys that was not the fish that I'm talking about that was a female when she went down by here real slow I saw the head it wasn't the giant male that I had earlier this year was undoubtedly 20 inches though damn it <laughs> smoked the streamer though man it come out of there I saw it come out from under the roots and just mash it and uh, yeah that's not exactly I could feel my drag needed slightly tightened there and I, as I was trying to tighten it I, I had my lo my rod low but uh, it, it was pulling just enough drag that it loosened up my uh, tension enough there that it not what the doctor ordered right, yeah it's having a little bit of action up through here um, <clears throat> I did pick up a person's boot prints I'm not sure if they're still up through here or not but they were little little spill right here there should be something definitely in that should have been if that person 
possibly fish this, then I might not be having as good a chance as here. That's not even spinning. Looks like there's a little undercut rock right over there. Mm. Tell you what, I'm gonna let this go into this current and spin. Possibly there's something under that rock right there. Really? Oh my goodness! Decent one there. I don't know how decent, but it's not bad. be about 17 18 ish I would say if I had to guess right in the net kaboom baby kaboom <laughs> nice little stool here to put my oh yeah yeah this this dude's definitely in the definitely in the uh 18 inch range <laughs> right back under your rock <sighs> love it <laughs> that makes up a little bit for the uh, one that I lost earlier there that thing was definitely substantially bigger than that it was in the 2021 20, mark range so all right, well, I'm getting into them up through here, so hopefully uh, maybe I can find another spot that's got a nice undercut. So that's where they're at. Undercut root, undercut rock. So stay tuned for some more, guys. Should be something going on right here, if I had to guess. Oh my god, that's big. Damn big. That's really big. <laughs> and the freaking spinner falls out. Right at the last minute. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> wow, that's the, that's a massive freaking trout right there. Ah, there was two of them actually. I saw the freaking one of them just hammered as soon as it hit, and then uh, the other one nailed it or one after it. So, all right, guys. Well, I'm gonna get my spinner out of my net here. Grab a pick of this freaking massive magnum and uh, it's like a football wild or for sure hold over really full fin everything is full really colorful yeah. all right guys i'm gonna uh get some pics here quick and uh stay tuned get it back in there all right guys check out this absolute freaking massive mago that i just ripped out <laughs> it's 
Good lord. Grab a pick over here. He just peaced out, guys. Heading back up. Oh, man, they got it. Freaking got it. <laughs> oh, I love it. <laughs> Freaking smoke the streamer, baby. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. Got all kinds of crap in here. <sighs> Boy, he's a feisty one. <sighs> all right, guys. Well, I am going to uh, set up here and grab a couple photos of this stud. I can't tell if it's a male or female. Heavy, heavy. I'm saying we're getting some uh, thermal refuge here a little bit early this year. Kind of what I'm leaning toward in this small stream, but uh, I'm glad I kept these pegged. Caught or had had a big one on this evening. He got off on the streamer. Caught a pretty nice 18 incher. Caught one about 23. And then this thing, which is supposed to be about 20, 21 ish. So, <laughs> alright guys, I'm gonna uh, grab a couple photos here. Get this dude back in its root ball there. Stay tuned. Guys, check out this freaking man. Out. <laughs> the streamer is out. <laughs> doesn't get any better right here like got done working drove i don't know probably close to an hour a little over an hour to get to this spot and it's money three big fish on the evening and only landed two of them but hey that's two more than i've landed all year at a time It wasn't a glare on the dang water. There's a giant freaking rock right up here. And I'm pretty sure 
That's probably going to be where the big fish is at. Oh, man! That thing was freaking giant. God bless it. It hit it. It was on it before I even freaking reeled. Damn it. There it is. Got him. Freaking beaut. Oh my god, is this thing gorgeous? <laughs> Alright, guys, I am going to uh, grab a couple picks. Beautiful male. This thing is gorgeous. Get him, get a couple picks and get him back in there. Stay tuned. <laughs> Alright, guys, check out this absolute freaking beauty of a male. Got a couple pictures of this big dude. Gonna get him put back in here. What a gorgeous brown. Alright, one just come out and smashed it. Didn't get hooked. Oh. That's a dandy. <laughs> gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous wild brown right there, guys. Hey, buddy. Hey. <laughs> well, he's hooked in a spot where should pop right now, but... Oh. There we go. Man, is that thing pretty? I'm gonna show him off here in just a second if he cooperates. Check out the colors on that thing. Beautiful. Alright. Well, hopefully... I didn't just blow the hole up there. Oh man, that was bigger. somehow oh. well, this one's a little bit nicer <laughs> oh, well, this one's a beaut. Come on, dude. Ouch. 
Got him. All right, guys, I'm gonna show this beauty off if he settles down. Man, come on, dude. He is not settling down much. Good Lord. Come on, buddy. Nice male. All right, guys. I think I'm gonna call it about a wrap on that one. Um, what a night. Three big opportunities for being May. I think it's May 9th. Um, just usually don't get opportunities like that on a small stream like this with the conditions especially. Like there, there's not, it's pretty clear. Honestly, kind of deep in the or murky in the deeper spots, but other than that, it's it's fairly fairly clear. So, all right, guys, hope you all enjoyed. Uh, as always, like, comment, subscribe. Catch you on the next episode of Chasing the Wild.